Hi guys. So this is practice number one for how to do the standard algorithm method when you're multiplying numbers. So we're gonna start with a two digit by two digit number. And on this slide, you can tell that it says 25 times 59, but I wrote it as 59 times 25. You wanna make sure that on your piece of paper, you always write the larger number on top. So 59 is larger than 25, which is why I wrote 59 first. So again, make sure you have that piece of paper. You can see that I have different colors here. You can use different colors if you'd like and follow along with me, or you can simply just use a pencil or a pen, some kind of writing utensil that will work perfectly. So um, remember that during this video, you may pause it at any time. You may work ahead and then you may check with my work as we go. All right. So I am going to start when I first start multiplying with standard algorithm, I'm gonna start in the smallest place value of my bottom number. So 25 is my bottom number, and my smallest place value is the five, which is in the ones place. So in other words, I'm gonna look at this as 59 times five. What is 59 five times, okay? So five times nine is 45. So I'm gonna write the five in the ones place, and I'm gonna carry that four, which is really a value of 40, up above the five. So now I'm gonna do five times five. Five times five I know is 25. 25 plus four is 29. All right, so in other words, 59 times five is 295. All right, so now I've used all of the digits in the top number, multiplying it by the ones place. So I can cross that out. I can also cross out that four because we aren't gonna use that anymore, all right? So now it's important that after we're done with the ones place, I make sure that I know that I have nothing in the ones place anymore. So that's when we put this very important zero placeholder in our ones place to show that we aren't gonna be multiplying and get anything in the ones place anymore. Because how we're gonna look at this number now is 59 times 20. That two is in the tens place, which means the two has a value of 20, okay? So we are gonna take our two, we're gonna multiply it by the smallest place value on the top, which is the nine. Two times nine is 18, so I'm gonna put my eight down and carry that one, carry that value of 10. Two times five is 10, plus one is 11, all right? So in other words, 59, 20 times is 1,180, okay? So now we've done all of our multiplying that we need to. And the last part for standard algorithm is we need to find the sum of 295 and 1,180. So I'm going to add those numbers up and it's very important that they line up. If they don't line up, it's, it's easier to make a mistake that way. So we wanna make sure that our ones place is lined up, our tens, our hundreds, our thousands, and then we can start to add. So five plus zero is five. Nine plus eight is 17. I carried that other place value. One plus two plus one is four. And one plus nothing is one. So now I know that 59 times 25 is 1,475. How'd you do?